Hello. What's up? How are you guys? I'm good. How are you? I'm well, thank you. Are you ready for your 73 questions today? Yeah, let's get it. All right. First, who are you guys? Uh, I'm Jack Hempill. I'm from Raleigh, North Carolina. I'm a sophomore. Um, I'm like 6'9". I, uh, I'm a advertising major in the School of Communications here at BU. Beautiful. My name is Ethan Britton Watts. I'm a 6'2 freshman from Indianapolis, Indiana, and I'm also in the School of Communications. What are you guys' passions? Uh, I say my main passion right now is God, family, and basketball. School as well. I'm a very family-oriented guy, so. Amazing. Uh, I'm not going to go with as corny the answer as that. Uh, <laughs> I mean, I, those things are great, but uh, I'll say like passions other than basketball would be like music, movies, um, different shows, like different types of like entertainment. I like music a lot too, though. I'm a big music guy. Yeah, <laughs> nah, he is, he is. I went like fa some fashion. What's your guys' favorite song? Any Chris Brown song, but for yeah, that's that's the Chris Brown fan right here. Uh, I don't know. I like I like so many different like like Justin Bieber, Justin Timberlake, John Mayer. But then I'll like get into like the other stuff too, like a little more like rap stuff. All, all types. Of, I I really like all types of music. Beautiful. Okay, what's you guys' most impressive achievement? Uh, I have to say, winning the state championship, 2018, my junior year. Um, big accomplishment. I'd say, uh, hopefully on Wednesday, winning this conference championship and going to the NCAA tournament. That's what we're trying to do. Why did you guys choose Boston University? For me, it was the best combination of like basketball, um, using basketball to go, go to a good academic school, and like social life. One to ten, how similar is Boston University to the movies? One, nothing like it, or ten, it's identical. What, what movie? Any movie, just the party scenes and movies. Uh, so the most disrespectful scene to BU is in uh, The Social Network, <laughs> when they're like, at the very beginning, when, when he's like, uh, Mark Zuckerberg is saying that she shouldn't have to study because she goes to BU. I like, BU is like super hard, like, I guess because he goes to Harvard, I don't know. If you Google like hardest school in the country, BU is number one. So fair enough. Yeah, tell that to the people who made that <laughs> people who made that movie. If you had to choose a song to describe your college experience, what would you choose? Um, I don't even know. Probably like Young Boy or something like that. Just very like on the go, you know, just having a good time. Uh, mm. With your boys, I don't know. Like I'm a young boy guy too, so I'd say probably bang out by young boy. Okay, what's your all-time favorite thing about Boston University? Um, just being with the guys as much as we yeah. are. That's just kind of you know we're all together. Like, so yeah, we like our teammates a lot, so it's kind of a corny answer, but <laughs> we like we like. What's a Boston University stereotype that holds true? I mean, stereotype. I think it, uh, probably just like being a, around. Like, there's a lot of like wealthy people like, that go here. Okay, where are we right now? We're on Com Ave, in between like Student Health and Aganis and uh, FedRec right here. Okay, can you show me a little bit more of the campus? Yeah, let's do it. Awesome. Let's do it. Rate your dining hall experience one to ten. I love our dining hall. Uh, I'd say eight. Okay. Point. I'd a solid five. <laughs> What's the not, best dining busy. hall on campus? Bay State. Everyone, everyone says Bay State. What's the worst thing you've ever eaten in the dining halls? The meatloaf looks terrible. I've never tried it. But. What's the go-to place for late night snacks? Uh, late night. Yeah, there's like a late night dining hall. What clubs are you guys involved in on campus? None. Basketball. <laughs> 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 Is it hard being a student athlete? Yeah, definitely. Time management. Yes, time management. Um, you kind of your coaches like run your life. It's like a business. It's not about having fun. It's about like winning and making money like for them. So. Mm, okay, fair enough. Who's your ride or die on campus? Uh, my roommate, Damon Tate. Uh huh. Uh, my ride or die. I'll say my roommate. Garrett Pasco. Okay, is there Greek life on campus? Yeah, yes, yeah, there is. If you had to guess, what percentage of your campus is involved in Greek life? Probably like 10%, 15 maybe. Are you guys in a frat? No. 
If you're, since you're not in one, do you experience FOMO? No. <laughs> <laughs> Which house throws the best parties? Um, a lot, like all the like houses in Austin, those are like where the house parties are. How often do BU students go out? Every weekend. Yeah, if you don't play a sport, even you're like, I have one more free time, you can probably go out like three times a week, something like that. What's a typical BU party outfit? For, uh, all right, girls all wear the exact same thing. It's uh, <laughs> it's like tight jeans, like some boot type things, and like a crop top. <laughs> and I don't know how they like aren't super cold. How I have a lot, a lot of respect for their toughness in this weather. Mm. I've seen a bunch of jerseys and jeans and pants. Definitely like uh, it's usually like a typical black pair of pants okay. plus like jeans and a t-shirt or whatever. How late do the parties run until? Probably like, it never ends. Probably like 2 a.m. <laughs> 2 a.m. probably. If your school was an alcohol, would it be a fine wine, scotch, beer, or tequila? Tequila. <laughs> Why? Uh, I don't know, just on the weekends, there's a lot of, there's a lot of stuff going on. Uh, just, you know, people are alive and just, you know, having a good time, so. Does Boston University have any unique traditions? Unique traditions. Honestly, there's probably a lot that we don't really know about <laughs> or, or like think about. Um, I've been here one year, bro. <laughs> uh, I mean, I've been here two years. Yeah, I, I can't answer that very well. I'm sorry. It's okay. How late did the library stay open? You're asking the wrong people. <laughs> <laughs> How many libraries are on campus? Uh, uh, also, two. I'm gonna go probably like two. We have we have to study in like the like student athlete like study area. Like okay, so that's your center. favorite place to study then probably. Yeah. Okay, what's your typical class size? Um, lectures like, lectures are like lectures are like 100, 200. Yeah, 200. Discussions are like 25, 20. How many hours of homework do you guys do a day? Uh, two to three. It depends on the day. It always like comes in waves like. When you have a lot of work, I'd say probably like one or two. Would you say you're sleep deprived? I, I'd need my sleep. Sleep is like a big uh, emphasis for me, so not really. How many hours of sleep do you guys get? I get like eight. I usually go to bed around 11, 30, 12, wake up 7, 38, so mm -hmm. around seven, seven and a half, eight. What's the best tip for juggling social life and school? Uh, you just got to know what your priorities are. Know what's important and know what's mm -hmm. not important. And if you know that, then you're golden. Yeah. One to ten, how attractive is your student body? <laughs> That's a loaded question. Uh, <laughs> In my one year of experience, about a solid six and a half. Oh, okay. Seven. I I'll go, I'll go seven. Okay. Hookups or ships? What's the dating culture like? Um, Definitely more hookups. I think because, like, compared to, like, schools in the south where it's, like, not as many people around, when there's, like, more people, it's, like, less people dating each other. Okay. That more makes sense. kind of doing their own thing. Is your campus fashionable? Yeah, I'd say so, for sure. One to ten, how would you rank your school spirit? <sighs> definitely could use improvement. Um, i go with six. 5.5. <laughs> How much do you guys walk a day? Well, I have my scooter, so I wouldn't walk in very much to class, but since I don't have my scooter anymore, I'm walking to class every day. So. What happened to your scooter? Somebody booked it. <laughs> it was taken from me without my permission. I'm still looking for it. So do a lot of other students use bikes, skateboards, or scooters? Yeah. yeah. How would you describe the vibe of your campus? The vibe? Chill vibes until nighttime. Yeah, I say it's like pretty academic until like people go out. People like that fun. How athletic would you rank your school from Olympian to part-time couch potato? Closer to the Olympian side. You mean like you mean like regular people? Yeah. Oh. Uh, Just the student body. Yeah, it's pretty fit people. Do you have to dress up to go to class, or can you just bum it? Yeah, we, I never dress up. Some people, a lot of people do though, but no, nah, I never have. What's the typical temperature during the winter? It was a. Uh, it wasn't that. It wasn't that bad. Probably like 30s. Yeah. Is there an article of clothing that you see everyone on campus wear? Canada Goose. I see a lot of. People. A lot of yeah. A lot of people flex that. What's an essential item to bring to campus when moving in? Uh, PS4 Xbox. <laughs> You're gonna go crazy if you don't have one of those and chill out. Or I say a, a fan, cause like 
They have like, a lot of dorms have like heating, but not good like cooling when it gets hot. How often do you guys leave campus? Um, not very often. I mean, with like basketball and everything, only just really for travel for basketball or like going out to other places. Okay, do you guys feel safe walking through campus at nighttime? Yeah. yeah. Okay, what year are people allowed to move off campus? Sophomore year. How close is the nearest airport? Airport, probably like 20 minutes, Boston Logan. Fill in the blank. If I had known blank about my school, I would have never chosen it. Uh, uh, if I had known how hard, uh, if I, uh, I don't want to say how like a little school spirit for like sports there is. Yeah. But yeah, we're trying to, we're trying to help that. I mean, we're, do, we do, we're doing pretty well right now, so. What's the most embarrassing thing you've seen somebody do on campus? Oh man. Uh, I see a lot of people almost get hit, honestly. Probably people just like, crazy around here, so that's probably, probably embarrassing right now. Yeah. Okay, have you guys seen any celebrities on campus? Yeah, Mark Wahlberg was actually right here last year shooting a movie. Oh, cool. Yeah. Who is your favorite alumni? Favorite alumni? Martin Luther King. Easy. Yeah, Martin Luther King. Do you feel like all socioeconomic classes are represented here at Boston University? To a certain extent, maybe, probably. How often do you see the president of Boston University? I don't, I don't think I've ever seen him. Do you think you've met a future millionaire? Yeah, probably, exactly. yeah. Probably from their, <laughs> from their parents, definitely. <laughs> Is your school academically competitive, or do you guys help each other out? Uh, I'm like, my, we help each other out. Yeah, we study together and stuff like that. Yeah, we, like... Definitely do the majority of kids on campus want to change the world or just be rich? There's a good amount of both. I feel like there's a lot of like people who have like genuine uh, like motivations. Do most graduates leave with jobs? Yeah, it seems like it, yeah. If you could change one thing about your school, what would you change? School spirit. Yeah, more school spirit, like better fans and stuff at, at basketball games. Number one tip for success here at BU? Um, I'm going to go with the corny answer. Just work hard and do what you came here to do, whether that's athletics yeah. and school or just school. Yeah. Boston University's in Boston. How do you like the area? It's, it's cool. There's a lot to do. Like um, for for basketball, we have to be here in the summer, some too. So like in the summer, there's not many kids on campus, but like we still have the city of Boston to like go out in or go do things in. Okay, because the average age in Boston is so young, do you think you'll meet your future wives? Uh, maybe we're still looking. <laughs> <laughs> is your school clicky? Clicky. I wouldn't say clicky. I just think it's definitely a lot of group, like different groups, yeah, like different different groups, and I mean the athletes kind of stick together just because we're all on the same schedule. So. What do you say? It's diverse. Mm. Not as diverse as it should be. Okay. Yeah. Describe the best party you guys have ever been to. Um. I mean, any good party, I don't know, like a lot of like people having fun, enjoying each other, music. <laughs> Why do you think Boston University chose you two? Um, I think just what I bring to the table as far as athletics. Um, and I came from a good academic background as well, mm -hmm. COVID, so I think that. Mm -hmm. Do you think Boston University is the best university? Yeah, it's cool. We like it. <laughs> Do you think everyone watching this video should apply to VU? Yeah. Definitely apply. And why? Because it's, it's got a lot to offer as far as like a high academic school, and but it also has Boston here, and it's still fun. A lot to do. Amazing. Thank you, guys. Thank yeah, of course. Have a good one. Bye. You if you like this video today, please make sure to give it a ginormous thumbs up. Make sure to smash that subscribe button and press the bell to get notified when I post again. Have a good day, kids. Bye.